Hi friends, it's Rosie Rourke, team leader of the Rosie Rourke team. And I'm here with Melissa Hudson, my amazing listing partner and my business partner. And we are coming out yet to give you the spring market update. So remember how I've been talking about um, there might be a shift coming? I still feel that way. It's been a hot market simply because supply and demand, simple math, economics. We don't have enough supply and we have more buyers. But as the interest rates continue to rise, and right now we're at about 5%, and it's, it's volatile right now, it changes quickly, that is creating some buyers to cut, step out of the market. And some seller and some buyers are having buyer fatigue, so they're stepping out of the market. Then that means the inventory will start to rise a little bit. We're starting to see that just a little bit, and I wanna explain further for you. And I also want to let you know, when you hear about the news, when they talk about, here's what's happening in Washington, they're lumping everything in together. King County, Snohomish, Pierce County, Eastern Washington, Island Counties, every place is different. It depends on your price range. It depends on what type of property you're selling. And that is what we want to do for you. I want you to be able to contact us. We will dial in for what's happening in your own neck of the woods. But let me give you an example of my neck of the woods in Fairwood. King County states in this market trends, and we'll put that on the screen for you, that there's still a very low inventory. That's any price range, all of King County. But I wanna share with you what's happening in Fairwood, the 98058 zip code. Melissa, why don't you let us know what's happening? Like Rosie was talking about, it really depends on what you have to sell. When we come and visit with you, we're going to be prepared with a graph about what is specific to you. Whether you've got a condo, a single family home, or even a home that's in that higher price point, which a lot of homes in Fairwood are happening to be in that higher price point. And so what we want to show you is that there's just low inventory, but is again specific, not just to King County, but what's happening in that 058 with what you have. I was doing a CMA with a seller recently and she asked me what happens if all the other houses hit the market too. If every other seller is thinking that we're gonna get 100 over asking, you know, I want, the, you know, there's gonna be more inventory, what happens to me? Well, right here that happened, Mar February to March, I'm sorry, March to April of last year. This was, this blue mark means a lot of new inventory hitting the, the market. And then right here, the pendings, they didn't, they didn't go pending right away, but the buyers caught up and we continued. So we can have that conversation what that looks like for you and your house when we come and visit with you. Interestingly, this last weekend, we had four houses go on the market. Two went pending and two did not. The two, one of the ones that went pending went, had, had 23 offers and it went well over 100 over asking. But then two got no offers. So we started calling the agents that had shown the house and what we found out was that the buyers and the buyer's agents thought the house was gonna go so far over, they didn't even call us to ask us and they didn't even write an offer. So after our calls, we end up getting those two houses to go pending. So what we're here to say is we are here to be a resource. Our team, our amazing team, <laughs> is here to help you. And we have a complete pulse on the market. Whatever you're trying to sell, whatever you're trying to buy, give us a call. We're gonna give you all the information, all the data, all the resources you need to make an educated decision. But I'll tell you something right now, inventory is extremely low. If you're thinking about putting your house on the market, now is the time. Don't wait. Now is the time.